acceptable there. The view is definitely acceptable. Stunning. Okay, so we're down in San Diego and this is uh, licking a sea anemone. Go for it, Thomas. Oh yeah, how'd that feel? Huh? Yes. Do it. You're I think you should have went for it a little bit longer. There we go. Licking a sea anemone for the first time. Keep your tongue on it. You have to actually touch it. There you ah! Go. Go. Ah! <laughs> go again. Go. Go. Like you, get your tongue like in there. I'm not gonna put my tongue in there. He's got teeth, right? Well, like on the little tentacles. <laughs> ah! I just spit on myself. That's pretty cool, actually. How does your tongue feel? It's pretty cool. Feels, uh, my tongue feels like, oh, there's a chemical on my tongue. <laughs> it can't be good for you. It's numb. My tongue is numb. Is it really? Yeah. I kind of like it. Yeah. The bleeding? No. There's a numbness, though. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. Right? That's how they kill their prey, right? They uh, sedate them. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Does it have sedative properties? It does. It's really, really relaxing. Yeah, right a little, little lightheaded. Yeah. Nice. I think it'll be all right. Definitely something happened in there. It's good. good. Yeah, this is good. Okay, so you guys, next time you see a sea anemone, you know what to do, right? Give it some tongue. The highlight is we're, we're going to dig a snow cave. Building a snow cave and then spending the night in it. I mean, this could be game over.